U.S. Republicans seek sanctions on Turkey over Syria. Republicans in the U.S. House of Representatives have announced plans to introduce a sanctions bill against Turkey for its offensive in Syria. Congresswoman Liz Cheney said Turkey must face serious consequences for mercilessly attacking our Kurdish allies in the region. It comes as President Donald Trump said he hoped to mediate the conflict. Turkey moved into northern Syria on Wednesday after the president pulled U.S. troops out of the area. Tens of thousands of civilians fled their homes on the second day of the offensive. Critics say the U.S. withdrawal effectively gave Turkey the green light to begin its cross-border assault, which President Recep Tayyip Erdogan says is to create a safe zone running for 480 kilometers along the Syrian side of the border. Kurdish militias of the Syrian Democratic Forces SDF, control the cross-border areas, groups Turkey calls terrorists, who support an anti-Turkish insurgency. The SDF have been key allies of the United States in the battle against the Islamic State is, group and say they have been stabbed in the back by the U.S. There are fears the operation could lead to an ethnic cleansing of Kurds and revivers. A group of 29 Republicans in the Democratic-controlled House of Representatives have announced legislation which would impose sanctions on Ankara. If Turkey wants to be treated like an ally, it must begin behaving like one, Ms. Cheney wrote in a statement. They must be sanctioned for their attacks on our Kurdish allies. Ms. Cheney adds that Congress has long had concerns about the Erdogan regime's cooperation with U.S. adversaries, such as Russia. No mention is made of the U.S. troop withdrawal. President Trump made clear that if Turkey crosses a line in Syria, he would totally obliterate the economy of Turkey, and this legislation gives the United States the tools to make good on that promise, Representative Jody Arrington wrote. It comes the day after Republican Senator Lindsey Graham unveiled a sanctions bill, along with Democratic Senator Chris Van Hollen, for severe sanctions against Turkey. Mr. Graham is a staunch ally of President Trump, but has vocally criticized his administration for the troop withdrawal in Syria, saying the U.S. had shamefully abandoned the Kurds.